What's going on fellow Redliners? Welcome back to another video. Today we got probably one of the funnest videos on the channel so far. My buddy with his 1500 horsepower GTR and I are heading to the drag strip with a bunch of my other buddies as well. And uh, well, we're gonna go have a ton of fun. You guys should hear some loud and tons of GTR footage. Today I'm actually gonna take the gen though. Uh, and there's a reason behind that, and that is because I'm trying to get a baseline for this car before I tune it. So I want to see what it runs stock, well obviously with the exhaust and stuff, and then what it runs after the tune. So that's why I'm taking this car. Don't worry, we'll take the GTR next week. Uh, my buddy's already headed out. Uh, he's already put the car in his trailer, and he's on his way there. So I gotta leave right now and head out towards the drag strip so I don't miss anything and give you guys the best footage possible. So I'll see you guys in a few. Well, Redliner's on our way there, but of course we are stuck in traffic how nice on route right now to uh, the drag strip here take a look at the scenery well really not much to see as you guys can see there's probably uh, I don't know if you guys can see there's uh, the river that flows right uh, perpendicular to this road so that's what's over there we got a bunch of stuff right here charging up uh, including the v-box bunch of cables wires um, to charge up the GoPros got the mics over there got an extra phone uh, I'm fully decked out today I'm going in hopefully you guys will enjoy some of the audio some of the video coming up I'm gonna strap the cameras up top of the car and uh, probably put it on my buddy Pascal's car and uh, give you guys a nice view of how fast that thing accelerates it's a freaking monster man so to put it in perspective think of a normal GTR right so let's say 500 horsepower and then multiply it by three times, right? Because a normal GTR is not fast enough. Multiply the horsepower output by three freaking times and you get what he has. Absolutely incredible. Next clip, I'll uh, begin at the drag strip. I hope you guys enjoy. I'm really excited and I'm probably sure it comes across on camera as we go over some very, very tight bumps here on the beautiful Arctic roads. I'll see you guys at the drag strip. No joke, he even brought it out on a trailer. Just letting Jen cool down just a little bit. It, uh, it's pretty warm today, actually, surprisingly. The temperature right now is around 90 degrees with the humidity. 85 raw, 90, 92 with the humidity. So here we go. be a terrible time. Let's see what, what it is. Yeah, 16. This race, my buddy in the Golf R, have the GoPro set up back there. I don't know if you guys can see. Uh, it was a pretty close race there. My buddy goes, uh, and I'll include that footage uh, to come right now. I hope you guys enjoy. Put the mic in the back. I hope, fingers crossed, the audio quality turned out well. Please don't kill me if it's not. I try my best.
quick Jenny update for you guys. Race my buddy's golf bar and we're very, very, very close. I'm sorry about the noise. I came behind, well, my buddy's trailer to reduce the noise as much as I can. So I hope you guys can hear me. Not a lot of wind noise, but uh, it was very, very close. I think I'm, I'm having a really hard time hooking and that's because, well, the tires, I've done too many drifts and donuts. And, well, take a look at the, the tires there. They're, they're almost bald, essentially. So. That's that's the reason behind that. But uh, as soon as I do the tune, I think I'm gonna run this one more time to see just for like for like comparison between you know stock tires, stock tires, with the tune, without the tune, see how much I increase, and then I'll do another test with uh, brand new tires and see what the difference is there. Uh, I'm obviously with the tires, I think that'll make the biggest difference. So we'll see what happens. Got the setup right there, GoPro mic'd up for the best audio quality, and then my buddy brought his GTR. Holy cow, that thing's moving. 9.9. 160. He let off too early, I think, but 10, 6, 117. I think he let off really early. So my buddy's doing one more run here. Hopefully we can get a good one in. I hope you guys can hear me. It's a little blustery. I'm running over here to get a nice sideline view. Here he goes. That's a good run. He lets off a little bit early because they got mad at him. They were saying that he was running too fast, but look at that trap speed at 111 and he's been coasting all the way down. That's indicative of a fast, fast car. They got really mad at him basically, um, essentially because of the fact that he doesn't have a roll cage and he was running nines. So they told him he can only do one eighth mile, unfortunately, at this drag strip. Sucks, but we got some good runs in. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the audio. Well, Redliners, I seriously hope you guys enjoyed some of that footage that I've included in the vlog. We're heading out now, but I really tried to mic up the cars as best as I could, set up the GoPro angles, to be pristine and, and you know to get the best angle that I could possibly get and I really hope that it came across well on video uh, a couple of unfortunate things obviously they said uh, to my buddy with his 1500 horsepower GTR he did a couple of runs and he was getting in the low nines and they're like listen man you can't at this drag strip you can't run without a roll cage which sucks because uh, they only let him do one eighth mile so the footage that you guys saw there is really only like one eighth mile and he was still pulling really really hard that car is ridiculously fun. If you guys enjoyed it, uh, let me know and I will absolutely get more footage of that of that car and you know we'll do a ride along in there. Uh, he's my really, really good buddy. He just got it back from uh, Top Speed Motorsports. Did a 1500 horsepower elite package on that thing. It is no slouch at all. Well, Redliners, we rolled out of the meet here. We got a pair of GTRs, uh, a couple of my buddies obviously brought out their GTRs. Uh, like I said, I didn't bring mine out today for just the sole purpose of testing this Jenny out and seeing what it can run. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Uh, there was a ton of cool content and um, you know if you like stuff like this please let me know leave, leave it in the comment section down below if you enjoyed stuff like this give me a big thumbs up 
I really try my best to make the video as fun as possible. I look forward to seeing you guys next video. If you guys enjoy this video, once again, please do me a huge favor. Hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe down below if you're not subscribed already. And I look forward to seeing you guys next video. Bye-bye.